Hello, welcome back to KL Gamers. Today we will be doing a tutorial about how to create RAID on the Asus Prime Z590-A motherboard. We will be using three M.2 NVMe SSDs for this tutorial. As you can see, the model is uh, SX8100. We will be using the second and the third M.2 slot because the first one uh, is reserved for Intel brand M.2 SSD. We will install the M.2 SSD on the first M.2 slot as well. Uh, just to show you guys that uh, you cannot configure RAID with the first M.2 SSD slot. Okay, now we are at the BIOS, 
So as you can see, we have uh, three M.2 NVMe SSD detected and the Intel Rapid Source technology is turned off by default. So we are going to the advanced mode. Mm, okay, we are using the Core i9. And let's see what we have. Uh, we need to go to the advanced tab and the PC storage tab. And we need to switch the SATA mode selection from AHCI to Intel RST Premium with Intel Optane System Acceleration Rate. And just to make sure we are using the RST controlled. Okay, we are done here. And the next step will be we need to save our configuration and exit. So as you can see, the Intel Rapid Storage technology is turned on. So we need to save and exit to do further settings. Okay, after restart, uh, we go into the BIOS again. So after that, we can see the RAID is uh, already turned on, which you can see the RAID. Uh, we have two drive is under the RAID configuration. Okay, we need to do another setting here, which is Intel Rapid Storage Technology. We need to create the RAID volume for both of the M.2 NVMe SSDs. So we can uh, create a name. So we will put a uh, read XPG, okay? So we will need, we put, uh, we set the red level to red zero stripe, which combines two of the drives combines the two combines two capacity of the drives see we created a 476 GB SSD so we have created a 476 GB SSD with two 256 M.2 SSDs Today we need to save and reset. So as you can see, we already successfully created the Intel RAID XPG drive, the RAID drive. Okay, as you can see, we are already successfully created the Intel RAID XPG drive, which is 512 gigabyte. Okay, next we need to Google our motherboard, which is Asus Prime Z590-A motherboard. So we need to go to the official website and we need to go to the support tab, which is here and we click on that and will bring us to and we need to click on the drivers and utility tab and then after that we need to click on the windows 10 64-bit tab and after that we need to select the sata driver to download and put into our usb drive
Okay, after that we would uh, normally we would install Windows 10 normally. Okay, until this point, we cannot see our red drive. We only can see the first M.2 NVMe drive, which is not red. So what shall we do? We need to load the drivers from our USB drive that we downloaded the drivers. Okay, we need to untick or you can leave it. Just we need to browse the, the drivers we downloaded from the USB drive so uh, okay we need to insert this uh, read drivers opt-in controller read drive okay after we install the correct driver, the RAID drive will appear and available to install Windows 10. Okay, you see, the RAID drive is appeared on the screen. So we are able to install our Windows 10 into the RAID drive. Format, okay, and install. Okay, thanks for watching. Please click like and subscribe if you like this video and I will see you guys next time.